Well, an LGBT activist teacher in Florida has demanded that her students remove all forms of Christian cross necklaces. In fact, she is prohibiting them from being in their class. Oh, and not only that, not only that, but when she takes their notebooks to, you know, review and everything, assignments and whatnot, she's been caught putting LGBT stickers on the students' notebooks. I, I, I'm sorry, like, when all of a sudden did this be, you know, become okay? Like, your, your job is to teach. Your job is to not indoctrinate. Your job is to not advance your own agenda being an LGBT activist. Your job as a teacher, you're supposed to teach, follow the curriculum. You don't silence Christians. You don't ban them from wearing cross necklaces. I'm sorry that that's a violation of their, of their First Amendment rights. This is how bad the schools have gotten now, guys. You know I have come on here and done tons of videos ripping the school systems, guys. It's just, uh, it, it is completely insane, okay? Now, she has blatantly promoted a pro-LGBT agenda in the classroom, okay? The teacher retweeted this apparently during the school day saying, quote, favorite queer web series for the kids from Huff Post Queer, stating, Here's how to talk to kids about what it meant to be an LGBTQ ally. She is part of the Gay, Lesbian, and Straight Education Network, or GLSEN Leadership Institute. Rita has prohibited at least three students so far from wearing Christian cross necklaces in her classroom, claiming that they are, quote, gang symbols. One of the crosses, a tiny crucifix worn by Liberty Council's ninth grade client, is less than one inch long. Rita's demanded that the students stop wearing her cross necklace and singled her out for several false, quote, misbehavior allegations after the student removed the LGBT rainbow sticker from her class notebook that was put on by the teacher. Again, like I had mentioned, teachers have been putting it on all of them. Rita's lesbian partner, who was also a teacher at Riverview, dressed as a nun for a school spirit week, complete with a cross necklace that was made of skulls. That's right. She tweeted that she, quote, has a bad habit, and the point is to be creepy. Well, you've succeeded in that. You've definitely succeeded uh, in that. Uh, okay. Th this, is, this is bullying behavior uh, by the teachers, guys, in, in these just... These liberal schools, I, I just, I don't know how they get away with it. I, I don't. I, I saw the flip outs with the teachers that after Trump won the election that they, they said, we will not show the inauguration in this classroom. We, we saw the ones that were, were the one teacher with the water gun and how she was, you know, pointing it and screaming at Trump, telling him to die and all this. And, and, and now this LGBT, you know, it's one thing, fine, keep it to yourself. You know, if you support that, fine, good for you. But to indoctrinate your students and to slap stickers on their notebooks, punish them for wearing Christian cross necklaces, you can't do that. I'm sorry. You can expect parents to rise up about this. Oh, you can definitely expect that. Liberty Council's involved now. Uh, this is going to be good for this teacher. I would not expect her to be around much longer. We're living in the last days, guys. We're getting closer to the return of Jesus Christ. I come on here. I bring you guys these prophecy headlines to show you where we are currently living in this time before Jesus Christ comes back. And we're there. I'll put the full link below if you guys want to check out in its entirety. While you're here, subscribe to my channel, CardsFan480. Okay, most importantly, guys, if you've never given your life to Jesus Christ, if you would like to do so today, please let me know. Leave me a comment below. Let me know you would like to receive Christ as Lord and Savior. You could be born again, forgiven of all of your sins. Be saved born you guys you'll, you'll be a, you'll have a, be a new creation in christ jesus i promise you it'll be the greatest decision you ever do make so let me know it'd be an honor for me to pray with you today it really would all right guys i'll continue to keep you up to speed here on all the latest breaking news current world events and bible prophecy updates crazy times these teachers are out of control they're completely out of control i'll be back with more guys take care be safe out there god bless each and every one of you and I'll talk with you soon.